Hey. Me? Oh, thank you. <laughs> Hello everyone. My name is Surbi. Happy Valentine's week. Happy almost Valentine's day and uh, I hope you all are keeping happy, healthy and grateful. Lots of happy in this video, yes. Um, so, welcome to the month of love, the month of February. I hope you can feel a lot of love in the air, be it from your friends, family, boyfriend, fiance, anybody. As you can see from my outfit, I am in full Valentine's mood. And since you have clicked on this video, I am assuming that even you are not sure as what to wear on this Valentine's Day, which is just around the corner. So, you have come to the right place. In this video, I am going to show you five different outfits for different kind of dates, maybe like a brand lunch date, a dinner date with your boyfriend, casual day out with your friends or maybe you know just want to look sexy so for a simple photo shoot at home maybe so I am going to show you different outfits and how I have styled them for Valentine's Day. Let's get on to the video and let me know which one is your favorite. Of course, I had to start with red, the color of love. For my first look, I had a picnic date theme in mind and I have dressed cute and comfy according to the same. Here I have worn this super cute red polka v-neck dress. Polka dots have a cute and fun aesthetic just the look that I was going for. I have worn a white turtleneck underneath the dress that would keep me warm and cozy and I think it looks great with this v-neck which can otherwise be a bit deep and uncomfortable for a garden picnic situation. I have accessorized this look with a dainty charm neck piece from Lovisa and added some simple gold hoop earrings. For shoes, I have worn these white chunky trainers from Westside and I literally have been wearing them so much. I would probably wear a cute backpack with this to complete the picnic aesthetic. And hey, did I mention I could not stop twirling in this cute little dress. For my next look, I have dressed up for a brunch date with my galentines and kept things all floral and ruffly. A basic pair of black skinny denims to complement the otherwise breezy one shoulder top makes for a perfect brunch outfit. The best part about this top is this tie at the neck which makes it super glamorous. I love the overall silhouette of this look. It makes me feel super sexy yet comfortable. Hoops are such a no-brainer to lift up any outfit. I have added these chunky golden hoops and a watch to accessorize my outfit. For lips, I am wearing this stunning red shade from Nykaa, it's called Maharani and this is the shade that I am wearing with all the looks in this video. For shoes, I have my block heels on in brown and black, you can wear flats too. A shoulder or sling bag in black would go perfect with this Sunday brunch look to throw in your phone, sanitizer and other essentials. If you have a romantic dinner date plan, this is the kind of look you can go for and look all chic and elegant. Starting with a pair of nude heels that I can never have enough of, I'm wearing this gorgeous pleated mesh skirt which has a dreamy ombre effect in the shades of pink and lilac. To shift the focus towards the skirt, I decided to keep the top a little plain, so I have paired this white full sleeves crop top which has a little bit of sheen to it. Going a little extra on the jewellery here, I have worn my golden mid rings along with this chain link earrings with my chunky H&M neck piece. I would totally wear this for a fancy dinner date. Now. 
Moving on to my most favorite outfit from this video, this all black look with a hint of red. Comment down below which show does this remind you of? I am wearing a black turtleneck top with this four leather skirt. I have laid this velvet long coat on top. To keep things more in sync, I have worn these polka dot stockings with my black Chelsea boots. Even though this outfit is not very colorful, I feel like a mix of leather on the skirt, velvet in the coat and mesh stockings all into one makes for a beautiful and textured look. This red beret is the new love of my life and of course I had to add a hint of red because it is such a valentine color, perfect romantic vintage vibe. I'm again wearing my chunky necklace from H&M. It is such a statement piece and I have been obsessively wearing this with every outfit. BRB Paris calling. warm along with adding to the casual aesthetic and that brings us to the last look i am loki obsessed with this animal print for fur coat and had to add this in the video Adding a fur coat over any outfit makes it fancy instantly while keeping you warm. It would make it look like you have put in a lot of thought and effort while actually you have not. The curls in the hair make it a more romantic Valentine's Day look along with this beautiful bold red lip. These wide leg pants with tassels at the bottom are my favorite right now because they make me feel chic and confident at the same time. I have worn black boots to complete this edgy look and that was it for our last look. So how was it? Uh, that was all for this video. I hope you liked it. As you can see, I was really excited to film this video and uh, share these looks with you and I still am to see your reaction. So let me know which one was your favorite look from this video. I think my favorite was obviously the black on black with the, you know, the overcoat and everything that made me feel like I just want to go to Paris right now. Tell me which was your favorite outfit and which one of these would you like to wear this Valentine's Day. I would love to know. Let me know in the comment section below. In case you plan to wear any of these looks, please tag me on my Instagram handle which is for the love of. I'm going to leave it over here and in the description box as well. I have come up with these looks for you with a lot of love and thought. So please make sure to subscribe to the channel. Uh, like the video if you genuinely like it. I am going to see you in my next video. I wish you all very happy Valentine's Day. So I hope you have an amazing one with whoever you want to celebrate it with, whoever you want to show or express your love to. I've been waiting for a friend Asking what we've got left Cause you left me in